Here we go. Here we go. Oh boy. Split decision would be crazy, but doubtful. Here we go. Oh boy. Unanimous. Unanimous. Oh, it's 98 92, 98 to 91. So it's going to be a dominant win for Jake Paul. Yeah, I mean, he did outbox Nate Diaz, but Nate Diaz did a great job. And you see Logan Paul, he doesn't look happy with the win for his brother. And then when the camera hit him, he started clapping. But I don't think that a decision victory was in their sights. I think a, a finish over Nate Diaz is what you want if you're Jake Paul. But the bottom line is Jake Paul gets the win. He's going to move to 7-1. and one. And you think about that in eight fights, the YouTube star, right? You're not thinking he's going to win seven of eight fights. I mean, nobody thought he would beat Tyrone Woodley. They thought he would get beat by Ben Askren. But at the end of the day, he's 7-1 and one in the UFC, or in boxing, excuse me. So that's how it goes down. Jake Paul gets the win in a catchweight fight at 185 pounds in front of a huge crowd in Texas. Thanks for watching. This is your boy, Chris Cross. Hope you have a great day and God bless. As always, peace.